Well, thank you for purchasing Cisco SmartNet Total Care. My name is Rob Boyd. We are going to cover three ways that you can load and maintain your Cisco installed base information into SmartNet Total Care, or as we'll call it from this point forward, SNTC. This is our second video in the series to help you get up and running quickly. You should have already set up your designated admin as well as your administrator accounts because we covered that in the previous video. But remember, SNTC automates day-to-day -day tasks, things like keeping an updated device inventory, staying on top of product and security alerts, as well as managing device coverage in a timely and accurate way. It will help you minimize downtime with around-the-clock access to technical services, allow you to quickly identify support risks, and easily plan for equipment replacements and contract renewals. But before we can start realizing all of these benefits, you're going to need to get your Cisco installed base information into the SNTC portal. Now, there are three ways to do this. First, you can install the Cisco Common Platform Services Collector, the CSPC. You could use a third-party collector like Netformix, or you can also do a file import. So which one's right for you? Well, let's take a look. Deploying the collector is the most popular way to automate the data collection process for medium to large networks with at least uh, one experienced network administrator. You can order a hardware appliance that actually sits on your network behind the firewall, or you can download and install a software-based version known as the virtual collector. Now, prior to installing the collector, you're going to need to verify minimum requirements for host server, submit any necessary change management requests like IP address and rack space, provide SNMP credentials for device discovery and data collection, and open ACL firewalls to allow for data collection on any of those desired devices. But using the collector to maintain your inventory does require a little more technical expertise, but you can automate your entire inventory process. Now, if you're already using a third-party collector, you have the option to use that instead of the Cisco collector. Cisco can help facilitate installed base reconciliation for third-party collectors, but your team will be solely responsible for configuration, any data issues that then result. You can also collect and upload all or part of your inventory through a file import. This allows you to complement your collected inventory with an upload of non-supported devices, your spares, or devices that are behind unopened ACLs or firewalls. Cisco supplies you with an Excel template that you can just fill out and upload it right into the portal. This is probably the easiest way to instantly utilize the inventory management capabilities, but remember, updates are not automatic. No matter how you get your device data into the portal, you will be responsible for updating your device list if you make any changes to your network, things like um, ads moves or changes, or especially any changes to an address or a host name. And of course, if you remove a device from your network, you don't want that in the list either. So customers with complex networks or just a large number of Cisco devices, you guys may want to purchase Smart Assist Service and let us take care of everything for you. With this service, you'll be assigned a Cisco Services Onboarding Manager and the Smart Assist team to walk you through the entire data collection process, regardless of which data method you choose. The team will work with you on an ongoing basis to gain additional insights on your installed base and fully use all of the smart capabilities built into SmartNet Total Care. All right, after collecting all of your device data, you're now ready to use all of the capabilities that SmartNet Total Care has to offer, which I'll review in our next video.